Hello guys and welcome back. So in today's new episode I was quite busy and I couldn't uh, explain, stop and explain what exactly am I doing uh, because it is quite of a mess. Now the guys that they were here they decided to uh, take the window out and uh, the lintel above the window that it was sustaining all the ceiling and the floor above and um, they decided not to reinforce it with nothing so at this point i'm just going to quickly install some uh, acros uh, now the guys called me and they told me that is something wrong and i told them just to put some four by twos against the wind uh, against the ceiling and uh, they've done that i'm just going to remove it in a in a bit uh, just after i'm going to install my acros now when you are doing this kind of job it's quite dangerous so if you don't know how to do it don't do it uh, just call the professionals because everything can collapse at any moment so um, right now like i was saying i'm just going to install the acros on this side and i'm going to pass on the other side to install the acros <laughs> Now here we go, we are on the other side right now and I'm just going to quickly um, try to install uh, another acro. Um, as you can see next to the ceiling we have our brickwork that is loose and I can just push it with uh, the acro because they are all loose, they are, they are almost falling down. That's why it's very stupid to do it if to do some something like that if you don't uh, if you don't know what exactly uh, is happening and how it should be done because it can be quite dangerous now i'm just going to install another couple of acros and then we are ready to start to demolish i don't know if you can see but uh, some debris is starting to fall down and uh, that means it's, it is quite dangerous and nobody should stay underneath uh, that wall there. Now, I don't want to repeat myself, but if you don't know what you are doing, please do not do this type of work. This is structure and everything can collapse and before you are going to do all this you need to talk with a structural engineer uh, you will need the calculations for the steels and the spreaders and we have all of that everything is in the other room it's already prepared uh, now i'm just going to finish quickly with this um, with these um, acros and we are going to start to demolish a little bit more uh, but not before cleaning all that mess because I cannot work um, in that mess. It can easily um, create some accident. So I'm just going to ask for the boys to give me a hand with uh, all that rubble we will have to carry out. Uh, we are just going to have to save some of the bricks because we'll still need to do some making good at the end so yeah let's just continue with the video
all right so right now we are just doing some final touches um, we are ready to install our steel um, we are just going to do some uh, final measurements and make sure that the steel is going to go in because it's quite heavy and we don't want to lift it up and down too many times um, the aim is to install it on the first go so right now i'm just going to chip off um, some of the brickwork do some last measurements you can already see the steel plate on the right side of the wall and let's bring the steel in quite heavy the big guy doesn't have any problem with it so let's just put it up so right now I just have a small clip for you um, while we are doing all this work you imagine if uh, this kind of thing would have happened with us underneath this steel so when you don't reinforce it properly when you don't use acros or strong boys this can happen everything can fall down easily So uh, let's go back on our video and continue. Okay, so that was bad. Uh, now we are back to our video and we are just going to install some other acros underneath this steel beam and make everything safe and we can start to do all the making good. Okay, so now it's a bit better because the steel now it's in and it's pushed all the way with the acros next to the ceiling but it seems that next to the ceiling um, we have a small gap it's one brick missing so one row of bricks needs to be um, done so I'm just going to do that um, 
with some bricks and sand and cement and fill all those uh, gaps. As you can see that brick over there, uh, it will have to be uh, put in properly. And uh, yeah, here we go. Here it's uh, everything almost done. I'm just doing some final touches right now. I don't want to have any, any gaps in between the brickwork and uh, yeah the job is quite done and i have to say i'm happy with it now everything is safe So all right, job completed. As you can see, everything was done. Everything is filled. You can see the steel plate right here, which our uh, steel beam is sitting on. That is the spreader that is going to spread all the weight onto that wall. So uh, pretty much here, everything kind of done because I will still need to fill up the, the door on our right side i'm just going to do some block work over there and um, i'm just going to let you with the video and at this point i'm just going to tell you don't forget to like and subscribe and see you on the next one one piece of block wood timber and that's it you don't need to buy a tool now <laughs> <laughs>